Okay, so confession time. I have never fully completed Persona 3. <gasps> yes, I know. I'm a fake fan. Burn me at the stake. Whatever. I started the game on the PS2 FES version and just stopped playing eventually. It was high school, priority shifted, you know how it is. What I do know is that I really, really enjoyed what I played. Even in just completing the first few hours of the game, I could see why everyone I talked to loves it. The gameplay is solid, the vibes are immaculate, the music slaps, and the characters are immensely memorable. I've been meaning to return to the game for years now, so when I heard that Atlas is making a full remake of Persona 3 called Persona 3 Reload, needless to say, I became interested pretty darn quick. Although it is extremely funny to me that this was seemingly revealed by complete accident. Oops. This remake looks to be a full update of Persona 3, bringing it into the modern era with tons of visual upgrades similar to Persona 5. Well, Persona 5 happens to be my favorite game of all time, so I'm pretty sold already. However, will it live up to the legacy set by the original game? Or will it be dumped in with the endless list of bad remakes that miss the point of their original versions? Right from the get-go, I have to say that this game looks visually fantastic from what little footage there is available. It looks even better than Persona 5 did in terms of models and texture quality. Sure, it's not Final Fantasy 16 levels of beautiful or something, but it's still very nice. All of the character portraits have been completely updated and they look gorgeous. They certainly upgraded Yukari. Animations in and out of battle have seen a massive boost in fidelity too. It's so funny watching the original Persona 3 animations and how jank they can be sometimes. This isn't to say that the original game looks bad. In fact, I think it still holds up extremely well in many, many areas. But this new game is just a whole other level to me. An aspect of the visuals that I especially want to touch on is the beautiful new menu screens. Everything from the shop menu to the pause menu itself has seen a huge upgrade. Just look at the water motif on this pause menu, it's incredible! However, not all is well graphically. In particular, I want to point out the janky look of the battle UI. Of course, all of this is subject to change as the game isn't coming out until next year. However, it's just surprising to me how much of a downgrade this UI is compared to the original. The gun cylinder motif of the original is almost completely gone, having been replaced with a weird looking circle. Maybe this will be added back in, but who knows. I can see what the developers were going for here, trying to make it more in line with the style of Persona 5 and what the whole Persona series in general has been trending towards recently, but I just think it looks a bit jank right now. Moving on to gameplay, there honestly isn't too much to talk about right now. We still don't know anything about any changes to the battle system, or new features. A common criticism with the original Persona 3 is the lack of two quality of life features added in later Persona games, that being full party control and fusion skill inheritance. In the original Persona 3, party members are fully AI controlled. You can slightly change their behavior through changing their tactics, but what skills they end up doing are effectively up to the CPU. Cue endless Mitsuru Marin Karen memes. This was kept in the updated re-release Persona 3 FES, but was eventually changed in Persona 3 Portable. On top of that, when you fuse your Personas in Persona 3, the skills that carry over to the new Persona are completely random. This is incredibly annoying and makes it very hard to make optimized builds. For years, fans have had to either mod their copies of Persona 3 FES or play Persona 3 Portable, neither of which is really a truly definitive experience. Will Persona 3 Reload fix both of these problems and create the definitive Persona 3? We'll just have to see. I would honestly be shocked if either CPU party members or random fusion skills make it back into this version. There are some of the most outdated things in the original game, and it would be extremely surprising if they were kept. Overall, I think Persona 3 Reload is looking really good. It's hard to talk about it because we know so little about the game due to how it was revealed. 
However, I think this has the potential to become the definitive way to play Persona 3. Like how Golden is for Persona 4, and how Royal is for Persona 5. Sorry Persona 1 and 2 fans, you guys continue to be left in the dust. Suck it. Hopefully Atlas doesn't screw it up, and I can finally get around to finishing what so many people have told me is one of the greatest games of all time.